Okay, the one other type of problem that you may encounter is if you want to find the possible permutations, let's say you want to find the possible permutations of the letters A, A, B, and C. So there's four letters there, so there's four factorial permutations. That's what we talked about on the other side of your notes. Uh, however, you have two identical A's. So that means out of these 24, this four factorial permutation, out of those 24 possibilities, not all of them are distinguishable. Not all of them are different. So we call those distinguishable permutations. Um, and there's a formula for finding that. So if you have a set of n objects, it has n1 of one kind, n2 of a second kind, n3 of a third kind, and so on, um, the number of distinguishable permutations is n factorial over each one of those kind of subsets factorial. Um, and this is actually probably easier just to see a problem of. So, in how many distinguishable ways can the letters in banana be written? Okay. Now, in the word banana, yes, we have six total, six total letters. But within that, we have three A's that are identical. We have one B, and we have two N's. Okay, so the number of distinguishable ways to write them is going to be our total, six factorial, over three factorial, that's the A's, one factorial, that's the B's, and two factorial, that's the N's. Now, you can put this all into your calculator. Um, it's a lot of button pushing, just because you have to go get the factorial button. So actually, I think this one's easier to write out. So here's six factorial, three factorial, one factorial, two factorial. We're gonna cancel what we can. Here's three, the ones don't really matter. And then I'm left with the two on the bottom, but two and four are both divisible by two. So I can just simplify it down that way, and I end up with 60 ways. All right, so a similar problem is if a store has four identical red scarves, two identical blue scarves, and three identical green scarves, how many distinguishable ways can we put them on the rack? So we have um, four plus two plus three, so we have nine total scarves. But remember, that's broken down into four red, two blue, and three green. And these are identical, okay? The green ones all look the same. So the number of distinguishable permutations is the total factorial over our red factorial, the number of blues factorial, and the number of greens factorial. And again, you can write these out. So here's nine factorial, here's four factorial, two factorial, oops, almost messed up there. Okay, so I'm going to cancel four, three, two, one. I don't need the ones anyway. Um, let's see, two times three is six, so I can cancel those. And then two and eight are both divisible by two, so I only need to plug in my calculator nine times four times seven, which turns out to be 1,260 ways to arrange these scarves.